Elsewhere in Quebec, the province's tourism minister is promising to tighten the rules on short-term rentals. It follows last week's fire at a building in Old Montreal, which had several illegal Airbnbs. Investigators are still trying to find six people who are missing. CBC's Je Jennifer Yoon reports. Airbnbs are supposed to be regulated provincially, but they're also subject to municipal rules. This expert says that for years, that confusion over who's been in charge meant that the laws have rarely been enforced. Fundamentally, it's, it's a wild west. Today, the province's tourism minister announced that she'll table a bill to make some changes. Il y aura des amendes. Non seulement à la plateforme, mais également aux locateurs et non pas aux locataires. Walksmith says that's a step in the right direction, but more can be done to ensure safety. Hotels have all sorts of safety standards that realistically we're never going to get out of our uh, private apartment buildings. Inevitably, we're not going to be able to get the same kind of safety standards. He says though it may be difficult for large cities like Montreal to inspect all of the housing units that are used as short-term rentals, there can be targeted policies that can reduce risk. I think it's also very possible to imagine ways you could, you could operate your system where you identify high risk areas and you make sure that, the, that there's the proper resources put into place. Walksmith says that authorities must pay more attention to safety, especially with more people traveling after years of lockdown. The minister, for her part, says she is looking into how to make things more safe. Jennifer Yoon, CBC News, Montreal. CBC News also reached out to Airbnb for comment. Earlier today, Airbnb sent us a statement from its regional policy lead for Canada, and it reads, Our hearts go out to the victims of this tragedy and to their families and loved ones. We are providing our support to those affected, and we are assisting law enforcement as they investigate. We are also engaged with the mayor's office.